Hi there, I'm Suzette Kroll, Registered Dietitian and your Personal Nutrition Guide. In this session, I'm going to be talking about the one-week pre-op diet. That's right, one week pre-operatively or pre-surgery, you're going to follow what we call a VLCD. That stands for Very Low Calorie Diet. You'll certainly lose some weight following this, but the real purpose is to shrink your liver. Your liver is located above your stomach, and your surgeon has to pick up your liver to see your stomach. So this will help his visualization in the surgery, and if he has an easier surgery, you have an easier surgery. This is a low-calorie, high-protein, low-carbohydrate diet. In fact, it's about 800 calories per day, and most of the calories are going to come from meal replacement products, which I'll explain in just a moment. It's over 100 grams of protein and less than 50 grams of carbohydrates. It's highly structured with limited options. But the bonus is that drinking mostly meal replacements allows you to take a break from thinking about what to eat and what you have to prepare. If you're diabetic, discuss this with your primary or your endocrinologist ahead of time in case you need any medication adjustments. So the protocol for the VLCD is this. Each day you'll consume four meal replacement products and one whole food meal. You will drink four meal replacements. Be sure not to skip any of them. They're all important. The, uh, the product is called HPMR. You can see it on the screen here. That stands for high protein meal replacement. So when you hear all these letters, VLCD, HPMR, we're talking about the pre-surgery -sur pre diet here. So again, this is available in the office or online. When you make each meal replacement, you're gonna use two scoops of powder with water. How much water you use is up to you. You can use as little or as much as you want. I'd maybe start with eight ounces and go from there. Don't mix the powder with milk, soy milk, almond milk, juice. You mix it only with water. And do use two scoops of powder for each meal replacement shake. And again, you're gonna have four of these per day. You won't add in any fruit, any peanut butter, peanut powder, oatmeal, nothing that you may add to your shakes normally. Again, because this is a low carbohydrate, low calorie diet. If you need flavor enhancers, you can use herbs, spices, or extracts. If you choose to buy the product online, please be aware that there are different serving size bags that are offered. You're gonna use four of these a day for seven days. Four times seven is 28. So make sure you get a 28 serving bag. And this is what we carry in the office. The whole food meal will consist of two cups of non-starchy vegetables and one teaspoon of oil. You'll be provided a VLCD diet guide when you have your pre-surgery nutrition appointment with me. There is a list of the non-starchy vegetables that are acceptable to use in this guide. And there's a list of other condiments and herbs and spices and kind of free foods that you can use as well. If you don't see a food on the list, then don't eat it. Um, there may be other things that you're wanting to eat, and I get a lot of calls on this. Can I eat this? Can I eat that? Remember, this is just one week that you're doing this. If it's not on the list, don't eat it. It's very helpful to have a schedule to figure out how you're going to consume everything that you're supposed to. So this schedule is based on being awake, awake from 6 in the morning to 10 at night. So you might start the first meal replacement shake one hour after you wake up and then have another one every three hours. So you have seven, 10, one, and four, you would have the meal replacement shakes, and then at seven, the whole food meal. Now there's nothing important about the order that you consume the shakes or the meal, so this kind of schedule would be fine as well, having shakes seven and 10, and then the whole food meal in the middle of the day, and then two shakes the rest of the day. That's fine. Okay, so the one week pre-op or pre-operative diet, the VLCD, very low calorie diet, the protocol is to drink four meal replacements a day. You can get the meal replacement, the high protein meal replacement, HPMR, in the office or online. You drink four meal replacements and you eat one whole food meal that consists of two cups of vegetables and one teaspoon of oil. You can see that this is a mostly liquid diet, not totally, because you have that one whole food meal. But this is very different than just consuming a clear liquid diet or any kind of liquids. Again, this is high protein, and that's really important to maintain your, your tissue integrity, especially that week 
right before your surgery. So be sure to drink all four meal replacements per day, have the whole food meal. If you have any trouble with it, let me know. I'd be happy to help you. I'm Suzette Kroll, registered dietitian. I'm your personal nutrition guide. I'll see you next time.